this no. well. Morning, Dublin. Oh my god. Oh my god, is it gonna shake like that the whole time? Sars, guys. Oh wait, that's having a fit. Hey, beauty. Welcome back. Today we're doing a video with the ledge herself, Belinda. Please refer to me as Queen Bee. Yeah, so we're doing a video on we discuss awkward topics. Keep in mind, I don't speak about any of the stuff with my mom because I just find it really awkward. Okay, so. Is it? Is it not? No, it's not your man, is it? <laughs> your man. Uh -huh. No, it's just haven't said that for ages. So I'm really sorry if this is the shaky video, but we'll pretend we're on like a little roller coaster ride. Okay. Oh, look at the daffodils. That's lovely. Lovely. So, discussing awkward topics with my mom, we're just gonna get straight into it. Okay, we'll start off with an easy one. Drugs. <laughs> yeah, well, that's one people said a lot. I asked people okay. like on my thing. So, okay. opinions on people doing drugs. Do you think it's a good thing? Not at all. There's no negotiation about it. Zero tolerance, no. Next. <laughs> okay. Was well, that? you're my child. My children are not anybody else's children. So I don't not care about other people's. It's not a general, oh, uh, well, you're at an age of experiencing a no, because you're at an age of getting... Um, but some people do do that, though. People want to experiment. But personally, even for myself, I don't think doing drugs is a good thing. First of all, it's not... Who, who said it's okay, let's experiment? Me? No. I'm a dealer. No. No! Okay, serious. If you wanted to do something that you weren't sure about, I would expect to come and talk to me or your sister. Okay, well, A, I would not do that. Like, then I you'd go to your sister. Go, Mom, let you know. Good to be hard, love. It's better just to be hard. Okay, drop kicking. Coming. Guys, I'm honestly so Next. sorry if this is shaking. Sorry. But Belinda's flooring it at the moment. <laughs> yeah, 40 in the Ford Focus. We're getting a new car though. He's excited. Okay, okay. weed. No. What do you need it for? Yeah, but that's not the worst thing that you can do. And you do. know what? You must remember, you're a lady. There's nothing nice no, about... No, don't go about uh, I'm a lady and there's boys. There's nothing nice boys about can do a girl standing with us. Yeah, absolutely. Nothing attractive or ladylike standing even with a cigarette. Hey, mom, have you ever smoked weed? No. I swear to God, because I'm asthmatic. I'm <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I can't breathe. Well, I know a lot of people And that stop I'm... moving the goalposts. Oh, it's better to do it at home so your parents are around. Oh, it's better to... No. Okay, no, I would never... Just start in the beginning. That's just weird. Why would, I would you want to do it? smoke Is it going to benefit your like, health? I don't think it's the worst thing that you can do. Why do you want to do it, though? Because people want to have the experience. That's why people do it. Like, some people do it because they enjoy it. Some people do it because they want the experience. Okay. I think it should be legalized because, like... What? It's legalized in most countries. Correct. And people use it for medicine. As long as you have the facts, you can make decisions. If you don't have the facts, then I don't think you must make big decisions like that. Not now, anyway. You're too young to be stressing me out. I don't believe why my mom says that she's never. I haven't. I promise you. I tried smoking. I didn't breathe. So. Uh. Hey, first of all, great back view of the painting. Mm. What's the coat? I. Six Back bitches. Stop. We're gonna be road tripping. Yeah, we're going to wrap, wrap the box. I really want to get a frappe. First, your sister to say morning and get a coffee for me. You Guys, know. I really hope this isn't shaky, but if it is, like, just give me a break, please. Because I really want, I love doing, like, the driving because I just think it's so much, like, oh, funner. We're going to need to just quickly wrap that present. For, we'll just put the ribbon around for Granny. Okay. No. You will. <laughs> Love you, Granny. Yeah, well, you're your favourite. Okay, we'll be back in two seconds. Now, should we just go see um my other daughter? Look at this huge line there. Let me it's see. like it's not in real life, but it looks like there's a camera. There's a whole shitload of lines on mine, and clearly that <laughs> camera is wrong. I feel like I'm on top of the car. Why are you so far back? And oh, it's also my cushion. I can put some jewelry on for this video. Look. Oh, is that a Rolex? I mean, a Rolex. <laughs> of course. Next topic. See, this is gonna be like yes. awkward topics, asking my mom questions kind of thing. And we're discussing them. Cause I don't know what video this really is, so we're just gonna go with it. Premarital sex. Oh, please. Now you stop. What? Where do you get all these stupid questions? They're not, they're topics that need to be discussed. Okay, okay. Life. Premarital I think love. Love is a bit of Oh my word. God, no mom. Not easy. This is literally, no. I think, I think fine. that's fine. I think there is absolutely nothing wrong with that. Unless but at what age that. of premarital? That's next. Coming oh, up. Oh, see, I'm just like. 
Okay, what age do you think is the right age? Explore. Well, there's no right age. I'd say about 25. What? 25 is when you can start telling me maybe you won't or will do something that I'm not in charge anymore. So, yeah, what that's age did you lose your virginity? Wait, do I want to know this? I'm not going to tell you. Why? The whole world will know. What's before marriage? What well, clearly? Like oh, yeah. Brogan was born. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it was definitely before we got married because Brogan was at our wedding. Fine, I'd it's say all about love. was about 13. I'm joking. I never really went. To, I didn't used to go out and have boyfriends. I really didn't. The first club I went to, I was 13. Sober. Okay. But let's no, no, backtrack on stuff. that thing. If I did that, you will not do that. You did. Did you do that? When I was 13. No, you were young. Of course. No chance. I didn't do that. I didn't have any friends when I was 13 because I knew he just came here. I know. I deported you. Overall, I think there's nothing wrong with it. I think the right age would be 16, 17. If Realistic. you want to go crazy, Ooh, 10. Check this TT. Why are you going for us? Jesus. Oh, that is going. You relax on the driving. Wait, golden arrow. Oh. And I'm like, what are they doing? Okay. Morning. Smiling at me. People are happy. That's. We must just be happy. Yes. I wonder if she won the lotto. That's what we need to find out. <laughs> I could look nice and younger in a, a masked ball party. Look, close. There's the two people like walking past the car and they're like looking at the phone. They're probably thinking, what the heck is she doing? She looks like a psychopath talking to herself. Oh, God. So, I'm just going to get this quick. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Broken, I'm throwing my money away. God, I hate her. <laughs> my sister is in work and she's telling the people that I'm filming a video for YouTube and they're looking at me. There's nothing wrong. You don't need to get anything done. You're beautiful the way you are. Dyke. The I'm way joking. you way. Okay, so basically what we've discovered in the first few questions is that my mom's lying. So she's telling me that she's never done any drugs. Mm. Coffee. Latte. Mm -hmm. Next question. Underage drinking. Also not necessary. When was the first time you had a sip of an alcoholic beverage? Interesting questions though that are really long ago. Like it's hard to remember. Um, so we were in like first century. Maybe about 15. Okay, so when I did it and I got in so much trouble but you did it at the exact same age. So like what is that all about? Because I'm the mother now. And when you're the mother, you're the boss. Wait, the first time that I got caught drinking. This is a funny story. Okay. We have to relive these things that break my Do heart. Do you remember it? No. <laughs> Ah, yes, when Brogan was carrying you. No, that wasn't the first time. <laughs> Actually, no, it was probably. No, not in South Africa. You were 10. Tell me, so I don't smash the car. Paddy's Day. Okay, story time. This is the first time. I'm not going to name the friends that did it, but like their parents all know because we all got caught. Ah! Oh, there's my oh, friend, Yes, I know exactly now, and uh, not something to be proud of. So we were drinking, everything was fine, and we were going to like this big field and stuff you know like people drink in fields used to have lovely festivals in the field but that's when i was younger and i used to just have water for some reason i was like oh my god let's go back to mine because my mom's in town so we were all at mine and then i hear the like doorbell phone thing ring and i was like oh my god who is that i thought it was someone complaining and i answer and my mom came to open the door right now in that tone and i was like i knew I got all my friends to jump over the balcony and then my mom came in and she was like, what's going on? And I was like, nothing. She's like, why are you here? And I was like, uh, no reason. My mom somehow didn't realize I was drink, or did you? I'm anyway. super mom. I know everything. So then why did you I let have, me go? Because uh, I don't embarrass you in front of your friends. Okay, yeah. So, oh, I, I thought I was a smooth criminal. We've got enough of those in our family. You know. <laughs> can I take your order? Hi, can I please get uh, one caramel frappe? Yeah. And can I get a 150 mayo chicken, please? Long story short, the next day her mom found one of like the bottles, found it in the bag, and then called our moms. And before they called, my friend actually messaged us and was like, my mom knows. And I instantly started bawling, crying. Then my sister came into the room because we had friends over. So my sister came into the room, she's like, what's wrong? And then I told her, she was like, it, my sister's being so nice actually about it. She's like, it's she's okay, it's good. fine. Then when my mom came in, it was just a bad scene. Very Wait, Did you ever get caught drinking? When you were younger? Well, I'm sure Granny and Grandpa knew, but I used to not really get into trouble. I had to quickly change phones because for some reason my phone's being really annoying when I'm like videoing. I had a case of Esprit, kind of a fruity wine, which was the problem because it was summer and it tastes like cold drink and we're being a bit rebellish. 
So we drank that between the two of us, sort of passed out, and then then I just pooped all the time. We told Gran that um, we ate something that didn't agree with us. Well, I've done that to you because do you remember when this is ages ago and I got really sick and I told you it was from eating McDonald's and like I was in my room for a week and I couldn't eat. So that's a fun story. <laughs> I think underage drinking. I think it's just inevitable. To be honest, though, like everyone is going to do it once. Like you, I think like, everybody will try. Yeah. yeah. Thanks. Enjoy. Thank, Thank you. you. Bye. -bye. Next one, this is a bit controversial. Teenage pregnancy. Just think, no matter what the circumstances are, it's just a pity. That's the word, it's a pity. Because when you say you have your whole life ahead of you, it's cliche, it's such a cliche, but it is the truth. Oh my God, oh my God, kill me. There are girls in the car next to us and they're like staring at us because they can clearly see that we're filming. <laughs> but it's not the end of the world. Not the end of the world. And what do you think about abortions? Thanks. I think so many people are pro, I'm pro-choice. Think, think that pro-choice because you... it's your body and mm. people don't know the circumstances so i think I'll and go, i wouldn't have a to... problem with it yeah. oh but can you imagine the little gingers running around yeah, let's clarify this because my friends are like no you will have a ginger child didn't we go to the doctor and i asked the doctor and i said will i have a ginger child and they were like no your grandchildren will be ginger like you could have a ginger child but yeah. it's not likely because apparently you both need to be blonde or both need to be dark well, well, um, well it you. actually doesn't matter because your dad was very dark. I was completely white blonde hair when I was a child. What? They have something to do with your adopted parents. You that have the most beautiful hair I've ever seen in my life. What do you think about this? Okay. Did you kiss a lot of people when you were younger? No. Like? No. Did you? No. I feel like you were a bit of slag. I was not. My friends, and especially the boys going into high school, mm -hmm. would say that I had shyness fever. Because that's broken too. She also doesn't She didn't kiss, kiss a lot of people. But you haven't. We go out, we go out, right? Do you know that like girls? I don't think it's a bad thing. It's just something I wouldn't do when they go to discos. Stuff they would kiss like ten boys. Why? Wow. Some girls, not all girls. Oh, no, none. Yeah. Have a dance. Have a good time. What do you want to kiss for? Ugh. And have all that spit and food and. Oh, it's just like a big thing here. It's like how many people did you? People call it. We used to call it meeting kissing now because we've grown up. We've matured. That's me though, because I'm just not like that. But you didn't. Did but you? I feel like if I didn't have a boyfriend, I'd probably be like that. Some people like it, and if some people like it, YOLO, enjoy it, have fun. Be well, also, do. at the same time, like you only live once, like do what you want. I know I knew you'd find that weird, funny, but like this is funny though. My mom, you did have a few boyfriends when you were younger. You not had like a lot. seven. Um, half, my whole laugh. Five. Oh, six, sorry. The nutter. <laughs> Sorry, oh, yeah, that just him. slipped down, you know, that whole <laughs> yeah. psycho side. Forgot about that. My mom had a boyfriend, right? And like, all the girls wanted to go. but she was insane. <laughs> Any boy I've been out with, she wants to go out with. So there and now girl she's that going always, out with a girl. <laughs> this girl always wants to be with people my mom was with. And then the one yeah. day she punched my mom in the face. <gasps> well, she missed technically, but she was planning to punch me properly. I still got a blue eye. I didn't hit her back because I was a lady, but in actual fact, I was falling down the stairs. Otherwise, I definitely would have hit her back. We think she fancied my mom. Like, people tell my mom that I she liked maybe, her. I think maybe, really. No, and we're friends. <laughs> we're good friends now. I think that's what... What do you think about girls fighting? Let's never. get on to that. Topic. Never. Should never happen. Usually, if it's about a boy, all the more reason. Because there aren't winners if you're fighting over someone. Can I show you this? Okay, yeah. But yeah. has been. Have you ever been in a proper fight? No. Have you? Mm -mm. Have you ever been here before? I'm I just scared. And you know, I have. Serendous, you know that I want to go. So wrong. I hate when girls fight. And if someone hits have... you, someone hits you. Hey. Oh shit, what is that? I hate when boys fight. Like, I find it, it so. It upsets me if boys fight even. Someone's getting hurt. It's mm. horrible. But there's a few rough girls out here. Most of the time, it comes from somewhere else. Um, Have you ever had a one night stand? I have. Uh, have you ever smoked a cigarette? When I was 12, myself I personally and two don't. friends, the whole packet. And then I really did have an asthma attack. I don't like so it. I don't really even like bad. when boys smoke. But if my boyfriend had to start smoking, I'd break up with him. Like, I find it so unattractive and I don't know why. Nice. I have done it before. I'll never do it again. You know it. Wait. <laughs> Shit. Do you know what OnlyFans is? Who? Hmm? Where people can sell pictures of themselves in bikinis and like toe pictures to people and they pay money. That's absolute crap. Ah. I wouldn't do I do it if I was broke and I would sell toe pictures. What I do would do would get that bread, get that bag. Loads of people are asking this up some on Ben. I love Ben. Oh my god. A lovely, lovely gentleman. I really like him. Just joking, he's an absolute prick. He doesn't like him. The relationships at this age. I personally think it's fine, but then again I, I do see the side of like live life. You should have fun. I personally don't think like you can have fun when you're still in a relationship. Yeah. I have a great time. Wait. 
my friends when I go out. I think that it's such a good feeling to be happy. Wait, can we if not you, do the emotional speech? I have to. There's pros and cons because you're happy, but then you might be missing out on other things. I don't um, see there's a problem with it, but I think some people that like just want to be in a relationship because people, they see other people in relationships. Turning 50 and you're on your own. Different stages of your life. Oh. Like, I don't really want to be on my own. I'm manifesting. Oh. If you have any single uncles, dads, hit her up. What do you think about me influencing? I think it's fabulous. Yeah? Mm. Do whatever you want to do. You have been chased by the guards? Not chased by the guards, but once we were chased by like a whole lot of bad people in a car. I mean, Baba saw hijack us, that, so that was horrible. You've had much more experience with the guards than I have, to be fair. They're I don't lovely. people to think I'm this big rebel that's getting caught by the guards something. No. This is no, a you're really not. different topic. Stuff like that. Like, I'm actually not. You're a decent young Just day. stuff that have happened. But I feel like, yeah, I said this in my first video. I don't want any of you to get, like, an opinion of me or anything. Because this is literally just what I think. And all the stuff they're making is a little jokes. What a cool lot of cloud in the sky. I wanted to do a video where, like, my mom asks me questions. I love doing stuff if you wanted to do Hop It Top. Hop It. What? Hop it. <laughs> I really want to do. You guys send in, like, your most embarrassing or crazy stories. And obviously, I won't put out anybody's name. We, we react to it. Such a nice. Day. So guys, that is gonna be it for the video. I really really hope you guys enjoyed. Please give it a And give it a like give it a comment give it a subscribe. Okay, say love you. Bye. Love, love you. you. Bye, bye.